What's that? What do they say? They're coming, they're coming, they're coming. Oh my. They're coming, they're coming, they're coming. Oh yeah, there's <laughs> <laughs> they're coming to take me away oh my yeah. <laughs> you wish yeah i wish they were take me away we all do take us away we are with huh? and everything. what's that yeah white, white truck <laughs> lock me up <laughs> hey they couldn't put me in a straight jack because my arm won't go away around my shoulder oh uh, that's right yeah wow. brian cardi hey why are you dressed alike are y'all stepbrothers uh, <laughs> you know we kind of work at the same place yeah <laughs> things we gotta do to look impressive there you go and, and behind us is a 10 by 20 mm -hmm. ESP panel home that we sold uh, at a big deal about a year ago. Yes. And we wanted to show you what Brian's done. Brian's from New Jersey. Him and his wife have moved down from New Jersey. They sold everything they had, moved here, drank the Kool-Aid, and now they're in. We're in. We're in. And uh, Can't get rid of us now. And can't. Brian kind of works here, too. You a know? little yeah, bit. A little bit. Yeah. In there. Fix things every once in a while. Yeah. Need to. What what I wanted to show Amanda was a before and after. So you don't have to move, but right there is a before. Mm -hmm. So the house that they have was built just like that. If you can zoom in a little bit, and you guys can see the raw panels. Mm -hmm. Okay, there's no trim. It's in in um that's what they look like before anybody puts um trim or any kind of stuff inside. You guys have seen other videos that we've done a lot. Just go back, look up our 10 by 20 ESP, which is engineered steel panel homes. I'm going to let you take it away, man. What'd you cool. do? My wife went on Facebook and found uh, vinyl siding on Facebook Marketplace. So we picked up um, somebody who was doing job sites and we decided to use vinyl siding on our house with cedar shaking the upside for the accent. Yeah. And uh, very simple to do, not hard at all. Mm -hmm. I did it all by myself. Yeah. And uh, had done in like two, three days. And that's all vinyl siding. All vinyl siding. Oh, it looks beautiful. Every bit Take of it. a look, Amanda. Mm -hmm. Every bit of it. Very simple to do. You leave it a little loose, it floats. Isn't that neat? Expands and contracts, and you don't have any problems. No buckling. Now, I used to do vinyl siding in Michigan yeah. when I was a kid. We used to do this all, all the time. Day long. Put your corners, J trim channel. out your windows. This is a little, just a J channel. That's all it is. You shove it in and go. Yep, that's it. Simple. What about? Screwing this to those metal panels, what you find tricky? I found it very easy. Just use this little metal screws, the exact screws you guys use to put the panels together. Okay. Just left a little bit of space so the panels can wiggle a little bit and move and shift, and you're good to go. Just like wow. a regular house. Well, I know you got the shakes up there in the yep. gable, which looks Same awesome. Yeah, I it love came that. out really good. I got it there, I got it in the front, and we got it on the dormer, on the front of the dormer, too, Isn't on the other cool, side. Man. And it you know what really I, I like about what he's done? is he went ahead and put a gutter on the soffit instead of using wood yeah and it hid everything it was just i told thomas we got to use that technique man i well, like I came that. Up with that because you know we were here one day it was raining and it was just all dumping right so i'm like you know on the other side it's gonna be terrible somebody gets out of their car it's gonna be poor yep so i said you know what i'm gonna try and throw a gutter on there and i told tom to order a couple glitter yeah me. i threw them up and they work great they kick out the back and everything goes out the back of the house it looks like good trim, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Awesome. You don't have to do anything. Just put it up and you're done. It's the best part about it. Let's look this side, man, before we go in. Yeah. And this simple. and this was a floor plan that, that um, we did. Yep. You took exactly the model. Yep. Didn't change nothing. No, we just went with it. plan and everything you wanted awesome. to do. And uh, that's what we stayed with. So they got a blue roof, white gutters, white corners, and gray siding. Yep. Nice, so simple. And we always tell everybody, kind of, the thing is, is three colors is really good to have. Yeah. And you mix three colors on the outside. Yep. yep. The cedar shake in the front, and then on the side, it's got the vinyl. That looks nice, doesn't it, Amanda? Yeah. And the, the maintenance on it, what do you do? Just pressure wash it, yep. and that's it. That's all you got to do is pressure wash it. Here. Wow. Any dirt, any debris, and if a piece breaks, very quick to take apart, put back together. Yep, yep. And you're done. This is the very first vinyl siding home we've ever done, mm -hmm. you know, or has been done here. See, I left the corner up here so you can actually see it's still metal. Yeah. yeah. But eventually I'll, I'll put some soffit under yeah, there. Yeah, I'll put yeah. some soffit up there. But I want you guys to be able to see this is still a metal home. Yep. And everybody to realize yep. this isn't, isn't cool. just wood. It's, it's a metal house. Oh, my gosh. Now, it's, what are your plans for skirting? Yeah. I'm going to do a gray, light gray skirting. Mm -hmm. Simple around the bottom. I'm trying to figure out how I want to do it, the transition between the concrete and everything. I think I'm mm -hmm. going to do a U-channel on the bottom. Mm -hmm. Okay. And maybe... Maybe a little tack screw in there just to keep it from yep. wiggling around into the concrete. And that's it. Just so it has a nice border on the top and bottom and it looks uniform. 
And two, and we're gonna show this house too, but I just wanna show the difference. I mean, all the different kind of exteriors that you can have. There's the stucco over there yep. with yep. that eight by 24. And that is uh, with the yellow. She did the Winnie the Pooh house. Yes. So there's a stucco and then here's with vinyl siding. And I mean, you can do anything you want on the outside. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Just yep, we even put wood on them. And you can you know? put wood on this it. This is not That's an right. ESP, but we could do wood just like that right? on an ESP mm -hmm. home. Okay. Not hard at all. Beautiful. Now, what's this at the end that you put up here? Uh, That's like a fake. Um, yeah. On regular gable houses, you they have, have vents, vents in the yeah. small attic area. We thought it would look really cool just to have a fake, fake little vent yeah. up there. Yeah. That's neat. And uh, just something simple to give it a little accent in the back side of the house. Yep. Breaks it up. Yeah. And it's very subtle with the colors for the beach because you're on the beach here yeah. of, at, at Incredible Properties. And the... The blue, of course, like the ocean, and then you have the rug down, the, indoor, yeah. the outdoor rug. And the funny thing is, we come from a beach town in, Lo in New Jersey. Oh, yeah, that's right. Well. So that's how we thought it through, because a lot of beach houses in New Jersey use vinyl or they use cedar shake. Okay. And then the real big houses, they use stucco and everything like that, like the true stucco work. Right, right. So we stuck with one of the theories that everybody else does in some of the beach lands. They use the vinyl because it's easy to replace if anything happens. There you go. You take it apart, fix yep. it, you're back, in the, you know, you're back in your house. keep in mind, too, I mean, you all bought the uh, Mary found it uh, on uh, Facebook yep. or uh, Marketplace. Um, you might want to think about not getting such an extreme color if you buy it somewhere like that. You can because, go to um, yeah. ABC um, mm -hmm. Supplies or you can go to Lowe's. Lowe's has a right. set vinyl siding. I actually had to get two extra corners for up top because yep. I ran out. Went to Lowe's and that's a right great there. color that you can that they'll always have yep. in stock probably it's a simple thing to use and okay everything like that so you, you got a picnic table inside. you got yes. a barbecue grill yeah the Linders gave me that barbecue grill oh they had too much they ran out of room in their little trucks so they dropped it off to me they said let your renters use it so well it works perfect very nice and th i'm glad you brought that up this is a second home yes uh because you all are in the forest yes we are mm-hmm in one of the best houses in here. It's beautiful. <laughs> eight by twenty-four. Yes. Eight by twenty-four. Single floor living. That's now. That's a question I'd like to, to pose to you too. Is that how are you and Mary doing in an eight by twenty-four? The two of you. We do fine. Mm -hmm. Everything's easy. Well, two and a half. I mean, Ace is there most of the time. Yeah, he he he's got his own little bed, or he just stays the whole couch and stays there. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we Ace. Put his bed on the couch, and he'll crash out there for the whole night. Oh my goodness! He doesn't move. We call Mary Mama Mary. For Ace. Yeah. yeah. He chases her down and sits on her lap every time he can. <laughs> Let's okay. go inside. Yeah. Let's check it out. Before we go in, I want to show you this great screen door he's got here, Amanda. Oh, this is marvelous. You stay, Ace. Ready? Yeah, watch. Watch, Amanda. Look. Oh, my gosh. That's great. Is that I love not that. not cool. I nice love that. Has a little lock on the inside to keep your people out. Mm -hmm. It keeps the airflow going. Yeah. There you go. You got a line here so you don't walk into it. Got it. That's all you do. Beautiful. Cost? It was about 150, 60 bucks, but 15 seconds to put it together and put it in. That is worth well, it. Well, I love Lowe's? it. Yep. At Lowe's. At Lowe's. But at Lowe's okay. in the lineup of where all the screen doors are. There's okay. two of them sitting there. Just said, you know what? Let's try this one. It looks great. I love it. And it what's it called? Perfect. Like a retra Is it retractable or what's it called? It's on a slider. Look slides in the that. bottom and at the top and you're sealed all the way through and it's just all rolls up inside here i love it nice it's almost simple. like a, uh, a shade like a window shade yeah yeah, yes, isn't it? yeah, yeah it rolls it's like a sliding up. glass door almost oh wow man you're gonna love this oh my goodness you haven't seen it yet have you no i have not oh look at the colors let me let it soak in for just a little bit cute how you've got that for your renters yes that's cute. So everybody knows what's really here. Look at the so colors. Oh, Randy, doesn't this look fantastic? Yep. And he didn't stucco or anything. Nope. Oh, the wood panels gosh. were painted. So he painted the walls and then just put strips of wood on the walls just to cover up the screws. Oh my. That look great. at this. He's going to have to make a stand. <laughs> yeah, I got to stand here and keep him out. Oh. See, so right here, there's a good one. You can see the wood. So here, yes. so we had screws here, screws there, and you just put a piece of wood over it. Look at that. Now, did you get this wood from Lowe's? Yes, I did. Okay. Oh, and look. Did you have to paint it, or did it come that color? No, it comes that way it in the box. He just stapled it up. Look just stapled that. it. Done. Put a little glue behind it, staple oh, it. Oh, my God. It looks fantastic. That's all you did on the ceiling, too, right? Yep. Just stapled it. Same thing. Little look at glue, that. A little bit of staples. Oh, my gosh. They it's... actually give you a pattern on the box when you buy it, how to 
pattern it so it looks uniform. They show you how to pattern it. Yeah. Box. Great job. So it's a very simple DIY package to do. Yeah. Anybody could do it on their own. It just nice. takes a little bit of thought and sit down and look at it. And okay, let's do this. Good. Oh my goodness. It's not hard. It's not heavy. Nope. So any lady could do it too. Yes. yes. Very easily. Yep. Mary helped me with a lot of it. You know, awesome. it's, it's not heavy stuff at all. So. You have a full couch. Look at this. I know. Queen See, I thought bed. the sofa go here. Uh, she put it over here, and I was like, "Plenty of oh. room." Oh. Plenty of room. It has a queen size bed in it. This has a queen. Yes, it does. Sleeps four. Yep. Oh. Stop. Car this is, is the best. ultimate rental machine. This is amazing. This is way better than the getaway. Yeah. That big getaway thing they got going on. Yeah. This sleeps four. Big picture window. Yep. Entertainment. Oh, full kitchen you. bathroom. You just put that on Stop. easily. Got a little fireplace here. Oh Works. my Has gosh. Heat. Good to go. Where'd you get? Did you get that like at Walmart or oh, something? Facebook or? Marketplace. Stop. Facebook Marketplace. Facebook Marketplace. Facebook Marketplace. So uh, we got that up there at a little antique store. Everything we find. She finds it all. She's a big searcher. She yes. knows how to find everything. She Look here, man. Even the little. I know. Look at this. <laughs> Is that not cute? I thought it'd be that. easier for everybody to understand. That's a light. That's a light, <laughs> that's a light bulb. Love it. And then there's a little. And that's fan. actually at Lowe's in the fan department. Neat. That is cute as can be. I mean, she almost got to absorb it all in when you look at the trim I'm around the to windows. No. Yeah. You would not think this was a metal house. No. No. Ever. No, not at all. So you got a shade that pulls down over that, yep. over the big window. We put shades on all the windows. It's great because it's very beachy. That's what it's supposed to be. The now, beach cottage. What I want to show is it's a simple. What it is covered up. The things are real simple. You don't need to be. A carpenter to do this, no. right? Now he is a carpenter, but you don't have to be one. Like up there, he just stopped his board. Just stop. All right. Well, I'll just one leave of my it open. Reasons for stopping is because you guys run wires. Yeah. The old ones, the first ones you built when you That's were learning, right. trying to figure them out, you ran sure like wires up there. So I said I can only go that far with it. So I want to leave that metal, and I left that one metal up there, Perfect. so you can still see yeah. there's metal in here. You know? I love it, man. I love the and I love the wood showing the knots. That's very. Um, Beachy. Beach, beach cottage yep. looking. Yep. Now, did you guys paint this a gray or something? No, that one actually is another box you can buy. I got you. It's okay. called Barnwood Box. Oh, beautiful. Just to match your piece we got out of the Barnwood. Yep, got he got the this. Boneyard. That was one of the last pieces beautiful. before we burned it all. And uh, yeah, we put it up there and just a little accent. Wow. Look at the kitchen. Now that's Mary. How Stoker. did you do it? Did you whitewash the top? My wife, she whitewashed it and polyed it. Yeah, beautiful. And Josh thought it was marble. It looks gorgeous. Wow. That's just whitewash and poly. Yep. Look, and they left the metal exposed. Right there. Done. The green. Just simple. Don't overthink it. Don't anything. overthink it. Yep. So that's, I think, some of the problems. Right here. People overthink everything. They think they have to do it just so perfect. So perfect. Look, the screws are still here, which yep. this looks beachy. It does. You know, it's like kind of beachy is like it just all, anything goes. Yep. The Look at screws, the top. Yep. The screws around there are still there. I like all that little stuff. You know what it's showing is when when somebody does it on their own, a homeowner, it shows their personality. And I think that's what makes a house look cool. It's yes. just your way of doing something. Yeah. And that's it. what a tiny home should be. And easier to do it this way. Exactly. Look, Look at door. this. Looks great. Look at the door. Now wow. she did the other side of the door. It's one full color. Okay. Beautiful. It's the same as the blue. But yeah. It's just one full Apartment size fridge. Can't beat that it. you can't. That's awesome. Yep. yep. Look how this, this is what Randy was talking about. Shelf. You need to do your own knobs and handles because there's it. a personality to it, and you want to match Done. the beach theme. Because we don't hand. know what you want. Yep, drawer. Oh, my goodness. Perfect. Gosh. Cute. There's some shells. Look, just beachy. This is like roomy kitchen. Look, you and I are both so in this kitchen. So much room. You can cook. You can get around each other. Oh, looky here. Oh, flipper of uh, the lights. Oh. Let me get out of the way. Yeah, so I can shut. Look. Plenty of room. I was trying to straighten it up. And right where the basket, of course, is where a uh, you know, wash and dryer could yep. go. Mm -hmm. Closet, bench. Man, look at the hooks they got. All kinds of hooks. So you didn't have a, a problem putting anything in these metal walls? No, Nothing. Not at all. I thought we were going to have some issues here and there. Yeah. But actually with the wood, it helps. 
believe it or not, when you use a piece of wood to put the anchors on, yeah, it actually works as a double. Okay. Helps out oh, really look good. here. They What's put a rod here for clothes. Yeah. Perfect. That is great. Just kept it simple. Oh my goodness. Look, it just little pieces. Look, he just stapled them up. Yeah. That's what gives it that personality, man. This looks great. Yeah, I love it. 32 inch shower. Yep. Yep. It's all you need. You now you got a 32 inch shower at home. Yep. You're a big guy. Shower every day. You do fine. Yep, I don't have a problem with it. You stop. Hello, hmm. Cardi. Shower every day. Shower every day. <laughs> gotcha. More than me. <laughs> if not, I go jump in the lake. There you go. There or you go. Them. Good to go. The color of the Keurig teal with the microwave. Oh, all this looks great. That's all found at Walmart. Oh, let me show this, and I'll show the back side of the. Man. See that wall? That's simple. Isn't it? Because it always stays. The door always stays open. I no. I want you. I want to show you this wall that you did not cover, but they oh, painted. Oh yes! I like that look. I do too. I, just like I actually like the look of those rivets painted like that. That's it's nice. so great. It does. And she gets the paint from Sharon Williams. Oh, man, that, that looks good. That looks really Williams. good. Let me show it from this angle. I'm not so sure that I would want all stucco everywhere. Huh? Look how great that is. I never looks. thought of it like that, you know? The metal paint you get from Sharon Williams is a little pricey. Yeah. But it, it's the it's, best paint you, you can get. You can tell it's is good, it right? Is it one coat stuff. or two coats? Sometimes it's better to do two coats with mm -hmm. it just so you get a real yeah. vibrant look. I mean, if you're doing yeah. it, it and might have yep. a little bit yep. of texture if you feel it. It is, yeah. Because we use I a can quarter inch nap. And God, it that looks perfect. good. Mary did a great job with the paint. Beautiful. Man. Now you got a whole nother level. Man. Let's go up there. I want to see. I'm excited about this. steps? The steps Look Mary stained them. That is beautiful. With a blue stain from Minwax. And I love that the uh, the baseboard is a different color. She painted that gray. Hmm. Sat here and went through it and painted it all gray. Yep. To match the baseboard I put in. Well, she did good, man. Both of you guys did fantastic. Rugs up here, love it. Yeah. And they're them little squares that you can buy. To what have else do you need? And what size bed is that? That's a queen. Queen. Yep. Could you fit a king up there? You could fit a king. It'd be a little tight, but I think with the queen, it's more comfortable. You got more space to move around. Right. And you can He's put some bed. trim on it. And the oh triangle. yeah, I see what we're talking about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a king, a king would work. Now they pointed this out because I was here last week, mm -hmm. last weekend. Look, they got the squares carpet. Yes. These are just little squares they put on mm -hmm. the top of the loft, and then they put a rug on top of that. And it's then put their need. mattress. That is so wow, nice. Wow, man. So nice. I'm loving this. Yeah. No railing, so you can look on out. Mm -hmm. You're going to come off this side anyway on your stairs. Yeah. Well, I figured that piece of barnwood would be your stuff. Yeah. Well, you're not going to go that way anyway. Nobody's you know? going to go that way anyway, so it's perfect to leave it wide open. You can see, and it looks great. Wow. Isn't that cool? I just, yeah, it's cool. It's just neat to think that the concept that we came up with, and then it's this working for people. It's a great design. It's working. Stairs. And you have full stairs. bedroom. Full bedroom. You could put a curtain up there if you wanted, and another sleeper sofa. Put it this way: if I didn't have my other house, I'd probably live in this one. Yeah. Exactly. Right. right. But I, I love yeah. the other house so much. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, the other house is so great. I'm just so used to that other house that I love it so much that you know. Yep. I like the way this one came out. I like how it's it's comfortable. Now, I good. think Randy would do it like the eight by twenty four that you all got. Is that because the bed is just wide? It's just open. Yep. And there's one thing you guys never noticed that if you lift our bed up on each side is one of our stars. I got my clothes. Oh on one really? Side, my clothes are on the right. Other side. And you guys yeah. built that. You don't remember helping me put it in there? Mm-hmm. <laughs> heavy. You forgot about it. Yeah. You put it <laughs> I, in I don't work. remember it. Yep. Yeah, Look at this. This looks fantastic. Look through there. Oh, it looks great, doesn't Isn't that it? beautiful? Yeah. And this is 10 foot by 20 foot. Mm -hmm. We sell a lot of 10 foot wide homes now. And this is 20 foot long. And probably, Brian, if you want to come over here, we want to talk about your rental part of it. Oh, yeah. I'll get right here. <clears throat> yeah, keep we got to keep Ace out. He's yeah. wanting to be in He's wanting part to come of it. in so bad. Well, I mean, what we're going to do is just basically rent it out nightly, weekends and families, mm -hmm. friends, when they show up, they got a place to stay. They don't mm -hmm. have to go rent a hotel. 
you know, and it's a comfortable place to stay. But nice. we're setting it up as the beach cottage mm -hmm. because we're keeping with the beach theme. Yeah. Me and Mike, you know, he's got the blue dolphin house. Yes, he we got does. the Jersey Shore house. Yeah. That's right. So Beautiful. we brought Big Mike in here actually yesterday, and he looked at. He's like, God, it's like being back in Jersey. <laughs> you know how I he is. I bet. Yeah. He had a great time. He loves yeah. it. He thought it came out really good too. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. So. So how do we? How do they get a hold of you? How do you? How do you rent this out? Um, Airbnb or what? Right now we're just kind of holding off. We're checking out the Airbnb thing, and what we're gonna do is um, possibly post a phone number on your website with my wife's number, and you contact her. Okay. Seven three two eight two two three three four zero, and. She'll hook you up and set you up to the, come stay the night or weekend or vacation, whatever okay. you choose. And you just had your first renters come yes. in on Sunday. Cute little people. Yeah, cute. They were, they were so adorable. They loved it. They had such a great time. And they came to, and they had an appointment. Yep, they came to look at houses. Mm -hmm. I don't know if they bought one or not. They may have, which would be awesome. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of one of the things yeah. we want to help you out with. Mm -hmm. So when people come here to look at the houses, they don't have to spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars at hotels. Because they want to stay here. They yeah. can come right mm -hmm. here, stay right here for the weekend, enjoy a walk around, and then Monday morning go to their appointment and then go on about their business. Nice. And, you know, meet everybody here. Go into their houses. Everybody's very generous about letting people in their homes. Plus do the Millican Mile, which Millican is a lot Mile. of fun to walk through with all that's the right. trees and birds and everything nice. that's here. It's gorgeous. I mean, it's coming together, isn't it? It is. Y'all did a fantastic job. Thank the, you. My big uh, phrase that I've been doing here lately is, uh, like, you know, when Randy said this is the beach and this is the beach theme, you all understood the assignment, okay? Mm -hmm. So <laughs> you, you showed up, so. Yeah. Well, well, that was our whole object, you know, because we live in the forest. We have a house mm -hmm. that's a forest house. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we figured for the beach, we might as well do the beach theme. That's right. Beautiful. She put her head together, and she sat here and thought it, thought it through, and she, we did a little bit over here, and she said... I want to do this whole thing throughout the house. And I said, all right, Pretty. let's do it. Yeah. So we Good. went from just doing that room and that wall to doing this ceiling, this ceiling, that wall, and everything else. You wow. would never know and this was a metal house. No. I mean, look what wow. I did with the base. These are all metal boxes that wired run through. Oh, yeah. So I used three pieces of trim. Yeah. And that's it. A little bit of glue. Store-bought trim done. That's it. Simple. And it looks very nice. It covers it up. And you would never even tell that there's no. You don't think there. about it, man. I love it. Yep. You know? This is it's so nice to see it come together. It's something you wanted to happen and somebody took your idea and that's exactly mm -hmm. what we wanted them to do. I Thank love it. Thank you, man. No Good problem. job. We'll right, do buddy. it all day long. Uh awesome. telephone number just one more time. It's gonna be seven three two eight two two three three four seven and ask for Mary and she'll set you up. All right. All right. Good How deal. much a night? Uh, I think we're going to do about 100 bucks a night. Mm -hmm. There you go. And then uh, keep it nice and even and simple. Yeah. yeah. You know, when you get all the amenities, you can make yourself at home and enjoy the stuff. If you want mm -hmm. to cook, you want to go out and eat, you're more than welcome. All the brochures are here for everybody Tell to enjoy. Tell how close we are to everything. Gatlinburg is literally 45 minutes to 50 minutes away. Mm -hmm. Pigeon Forge is uh, about an hour because of traffic. Mm -hmm. you got the Smoky Mountains, which is literally 10 minutes down the road. So much. You could go to the Foothills Parkway, which me and my wife go to the Foothills Parkway at least once or twice a week. Yeah. Just because we love the views and we just it's it's a, it's just Beautiful. something we thrive for. Yeah. It's a good thing to good have. For your head, and the we, colors oh, coming up. It clears your head yeah. right out. Yeah. Every time I go up there, that's what we do when we get stressed and frustrated. We take a ride up there, we yeah. can look at the mountains, we enjoy the air. And plus it's a lot cooler up there too in the summertime. Mm -hmm. Ten degrees difference. Isn't that something? Just by going like I think two thousand five hundred feet. And it changes the temperature that much. Isn't that cool? But and Morristown's only 25, 20, 25, 25 minutes away. 25 minutes away. You got 50 Morristown. restaurants over there. Oh, we got Gosh. everything. Yeah. An hour and ten, an hour and twenty minutes. You got Bristol Downs. Yep. Nobody ever mentions that. Mm -hmm. And right behind us, we got the Pigeon Forge and the French Broad River, fishing all day long. Swimming. Kayaking. You know, right now they're letting the level, they're letting the water levels down because they do it every winter to clean mm -hmm. up and mm -hmm. you know get ready for next year. But um, mm -hmm. yeah. It's a great place to be. It Everything's is. here and it's so much fun. I love it. I've been having a great time. I mean, I've been working on this for the past two and a half, three months, but yeah. now we're going to go back to having fun. Yeah. Good deal. And we want to uh, welcome Mary's sister, Patty. Oh, yes. Is here, here for Colorado. for two or three weeks from Colorado, mm -hmm. and yep. she'll be staying here in she the house. She'll stay here? She's staying yes. right here. She's awesome. Staying right this here. is her house for the next three weeks. Yeah. She's getting ready to come in here today, then. Oh, yeah. She okay. was here last she night. She was here last oh, night. Oh, okay. We got her at the airport last Couldn't night. Couldn't tell. Wow. Good deal. All right. All right. Thank you, man. No problem. Yes. Yeah. And if, if you, you know, I'm sure you go back, he said his number twice on here, but you can also inquire with uh, incredible with Kelly. Yeah. You can mm -hmm. call Kelly. Oh, Kelly, Kelly. Will have some yeah, information. Yeah, Kelly will pass the, uh, the phone mm -hmm. number. Yeah. And if you want this house, we do duplicate these homes, we build mm -hmm. them. I think, uh, 
I, I can't. I think it's forty six thousand. Forty six two or forty six two. Forty two six is our, uh, or something. Is our cost on these homes? I mean, your mm -hmm. cost. That's what we sell them for. So if you're interested, give us a call. Come by. We got some on display, and come stay in his house. Good yep. deal. All right. See you, everybody. I'm Randy Jones with Incredible Tiny Homes.